For the first time in a long time, the collective feeling was hard to ignore if you attended the Syracuse University football spring game. Satisfaction. The crowd size was about the same, roughly 4,000 dedicated souls who voluntarily walked indoors on a rare, nice Syracuse spring day to get their football fix. But on this Saturday, they walked into the Carrier Dome after a thrilling brush with the past, as legends Tom Coffin, Larry Zonka, and Floyd Little came to relive Syracuse football glory. But fans still had visions of a 10-3 season just last year dancing in their heads. While always wondering what the future holds, Syracuse football's picture could not be more clear. The coach's vision is coming to fruition. A strong arm successor at quarterback is ready to lead. And evidence of who's next came blazing by. Head coach Dino Babers would warn that Syracuse has work to do. We're still not there. I know it sounds I'm like I am keep playing the same song. We're not there. We want, we need to have the depth that the teams that we have to challenge for conference championships have. And we're, and we're not there. We can, we can put out 21, 22, 24, 25 really good football players. But if we get hit in the wrong positions, we're, we're no different than the 2016, 2017. But the truth of the matter is, Syracuse football is in a different place, a better place. The autumn of 2019 will prove if the Orange have what it takes to stay there. For now, in the spring of 2019, Syracuse football fans are clearly just enjoying the view.